Hi everyone, it's Jenny here from Texo. Today I'm answering some of your questions. One common question is, what is email enrichment and how do you use it? Let's dive into the details. What is email enrichment? Email enrichment is a feature that allows you to receive email address outputs using Texo. Each time you use this feature, you will be charged one credit for each email scrape. I'm going to say credits, not email credits, since we are going to have more data enrichment automations in the upcoming updates, which will utilize your credits for all enrichment works. How to use email enrichment? Here's how you can utilize email enrichment in Texo. First, let's navigate to the automation store. Here, let's select email under platform. Here we can see a list of all automations available to use with enrichment credits. We can choose an automation, pick an automation that suits your needs. Each automation will specify if it uses enrichment credits. Next, what we want to do is we want to check our credits. You can check your credits from your dashboard, from your limits dashboard. Click on view your limits to see if you have any email enrichment credits available. You will also be able to see it over here. Next, let's see how we can use email enrichment in automation. For automations requiring enrichment credits, you can set up the automation as usual. And when the automation runs, it will use one credit for each email address it scrapes. Let's test this with the first automation. Find an email address. Let's go ahead and try it. Finding an email address requires two credits. This automation requires you to input a first name, last name and domain to get an email ID. Behind the scenes, Texo runs numerous permutations and combinations to find the right email address. You will also get a confidence score and verification of various indicators, such as whether the email is deliverable, reachable, accepts email and checks for MX records. For example, I will use a single input to find the email of Sahil Gaba from Google. I entered his first name, last name and the domain. and I can run the automation. Let's go ahead and see the results. Okay, so here's what the output is. We have seen his first name, last name, the domain, the email address, and the confidence score. We can see that there's 75% confidence that this is Sahil's email address. You also get the other data points, which is if it's deliverable, catch all, accepts email, etc. The next automation that we can try with the enrichment credits is the email verifier, which uses one credit. Let's go ahead and head over to the automation store again and try out this automation. Now, the email verifier checks if the email is reachable, accepts mail, is deliverable, is catch-all or is disabled. It also verifies MX records. Let's test this automation with a single input. I will try out Mohammed's email. I input it in the field. I enter the email address and I run the automation. Let's see the results. Okay, here is the output. We have seen his email. We can see if it's reachable, that is false, accepts emails, if it's deliverable, catch all and disabled. So this result tells me that this is likely not a valid email address and I would not use it in my outreach. 
Next, we can try the other automation under emails, which is find emails using domain. Finding emails from a domain requires two credits. This automation scans multiple sources on the internet to collect all matching email addresses efficiently using our fast servers. Let's go ahead and select single input. Here, you can input the company domain that you want to search, set a limit if needed, and find email addresses under that domain. Let's look at the information that you get. You get email addresses, the added domain, and in some cases you get the first and last name, LinkedIn URL, Twitter ID, and phone number. Let's try this automation with Arada. I input the domain name. I will set a limit of two email addresses and I will hit run to start the automation. Let's go ahead and check the results. Here, I have received two email addresses from the Arada domain. Now, what you will notice that if they have connected LinkedIn and Twitter accounts to these emails, I would also get those URLs as well. This is not the case for these two email addresses though. So that's it. Email enrichment in Texo is a powerful tool that helps you gather email addresses efficiently. Make sure to check your available credits and choose the right automation for your needs. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.